Good afternoon, and thank you so much for taking the time out of your busy day to join us in the virtual tour of 2912 Hibiscus Run Lane in Ruskin, Florida. Today we're in Bedrock Little Manatee Mobile Home Park. We have a two bedroom, one bathroom mobile home on our hands with tons of upgrades and tons of features that I just can't wait to show you. It is a little bit windy out here, so I hope my uh, voiceover is coming loud and clear so you can hear all of the features this home has to offer. Before we get started on the property, let's talk about the area. Ruskin, Florida. We're going to be about 35 minutes or so away from the Gulf Coast of Mexico, about the same distance away from Tampa. So if you're a big sports fan or a foodie, you've just got tons of things to fill your time with that. If you like the water, man, this is the place to be too. Uh, you have a direct inlet access right behind us over here uh, that is going to take you into an inlet that feeds directly into Tampa Bay. So with some of the best fishing in the entire state of Florida, it's right out your backyard. The uh, owner is very into outdoor, outdoorsy uh, activities with kayaks. Those kayaks are not going to come with the home, but if you are sincerely interested in it, make us an offer. Uh, they would definitely entertain it. So if you're into outdoors and low lot rent, this is the park to be in. As I mentioned, low lot rent, let's talk about that. We're about 40% under the county lot rent average, so you get a ton of bang for your buck in this park, close to nature, with tons of upgrades in this home. So with that being said, let's go ahead and jump into 2912 Hibiscus Run Lane, show you exactly what this home has to offer. For starters, let's go ahead and show you in the park where we're at, we're right down the street, about halfway down uh, from the uh, cross street there. The water is going to be one street over on that way, uh, so you can you know, just as easily walk with your fishing pole and enjoy an afternoon out of the water. Quite a large driveway. I uh, don't see a lot of these large driveways in this community. Uh, good sized carport as well. So if you have two, if not three vehicles, uh, easily fit here for you and your guests, which is quite nice. One of the items that's gonna pop on this home right when you pull up to the curb is gonna be this new deck. I mean, they just did an outstanding job on it. They built it out, did a nice stain job on it as well. Uh, owner recently put in some uh, landscaping and some mulch to really make it, uh, give that fun floor to feel here uh, on the outside of the home. They did vinyl siding on the front of the property. That definitely updates it quite a bit. They did not do vinyl on the rest of the house, but they did do it on the front. So when you pull up to the house, you'll get that uh, updated feel for it. Although they didn't do the, um, the siding throughout the entire home, they did do the skirting. And you'll see in the video here, uh, this skirting is in fantastic shape. That's recently been updated uh, that's throughout the entire property. So that's fantastic. Uh, definitely gives a very well-kept appearance. Carport is very tall. So if you have a truck or something like that, you're gonna fit in there with no problem at all uh, and be able to uh, protect your uh, car from the Florida sunshine. Two entrances to the property. Uh, first one is going to be on the side there. Second one, obviously, we we went into the um, to the front of the house. And that's where we're going to enter when we get to the front of the property. I just wanted to show you the back of the home first. This home does not have central AC. Uh, it does have several new window units. Uh, for folks who are not familiar with window units, they are as economical as they come. Much cheaper than central AC, and you can control the temperature per room quite a bit better. These items are going to be going with the owner. I just used it as kind of a staging area for when we came through and uh, did, the, uh, did the tour. Beautiful Florida day out here today. Goodness gracious. Can't ask for anything nicer than that. And as we approach the home, we talked about the deck a moment ago. Just three short steps on into the entrance. Newer screen door here that you'll see. All the doors in the house appear to be recently updated. That's gonna be a big cost that is certainly passed on to the new owner. The service door here, great shape. Fantastic with the uh, glass panes in there. And boy, oh boy, take a look at this. Now 
Now, if that doesn't grab your attention, let's go over the specs here. First up is gonna be the flooring. Vinyl beech wood, great condition, no soft spots throughout the entire house. Kitchen has just been totally gutted, remodeled, up to date. Newer appliances here with the stove and the microwave. Nice solid surface for Mica countertop. Nice solid cabinets here as well. Deep sink. Stainless steel on the refrigerator. And just tons of natural light. Updated lighting fixtures in the house. And you also see these LED lights as well. Brings down your electrical bill quite a bit, as well as keeps it quite a bit brighter. The shelf to put your, uh, to put your mugs, maybe some extra cooking uh, items. Now, this initially was a single wide. Uh, they built it out, built out the Florida room. And you'll see here what they did to the Florida room. Um, you can tell by the original ceiling here. It's in great shape. Nice solid carpet, neutral tone here. Good strong carpet pad under it. There's one of the newer AC units that we discussed. And the way the owner has it set up, it's kind of a hangout area. They put their furniture on the front end, um, but when we get behind the furniture, you'll see just how much this goes back. I mean, this could be a whole different uh, bedroom. It could be a home office, you name it. Another, another big item on this property is the owner uh, yanked off all the paneling and they hung uh, real drywall. Okay, that's real sheet rock. Um, hung it, mudded it, painted it. Looks great, as well as the trim on the, uh, the lower part and in the upper part of the uh, entire house. And they just did a great job on the trim. So we head down to the first bedroom, left side here. Now this is gonna be kind of a transitional room. Uh, owner is getting ready to move. So all these items will be removed, okay? But uh, you know, everybody has to have a place where they put their stuff. Another separate AC unit with the fully good sized closet there. Everything's brand new here in the kitchen. That flooring carries over. I got a tall vanity, a new toilet, and a new tub shower combo. All in great shape, along with a functional uh, fan there. The back bedroom is huge. As you'll see here, that's a king size bed. <clears throat> so you have a king size bed, and look at all the space on the sides of the room. Large closet, again, the upper and lower trim continues throughout the property, as does the sheetrock, the neutral paint colors, and the uh, even the sheetrock here on the ceiling. <clears throat> All the doors are new. Electrical's been updated, as you see here. That's gonna be another big dollar item. That's already been done for you. <clears throat> side entrance Let's take one more look at that kitchen <clears throat> so as we finish up on the tour of 2912 hibiscus run lane let's go ahead and hit the highlights here goodness gracious look at that just hang out there and breeze blowing your hair the highlights of the property are vast let's go ahead and hit the main ones as we finish up our tour uh, first one we got a waterfront community second one we got low lot rent got a small town feel with access to everything that tampa provides as well as the gulf of mexico and all those fun areas there i've got a fully rebuilt house i got sheetrock new kitchen new plumbing new electrical roofs dry as a bone all the flooring's been redone new appliances the list goes on and on. So if you're looking for a turnkey property with very low lot rent, literally nothing needs to be done, just make sure you bring your toothbrush, your fishing pole, 
and your uh, suntan lotion. This is gonna be the pro property to take a look at. And folks, thank you so much for being a part of this. If you have yet to subscribe to the channel and become a part of the community, please do so below. So that way you're up to speed on everything that we here at the Mobile Home Dealer are doing. And if you or someone that you do know is interested in a beautiful property like this at 2912, please give us a holler as we have a motivated seller. And we expect this home to move fast. This is Mark with the Mobile Home Dealer. Thank you so much for being a part of this. We'll see y'all on the next one.